So what team did you go up to when you were in the AHL last year? Springfield. Springfield? Yeah. I used to hate Springfield back then. Yeah, it's day. not a great city. <laughs> <laughs> they got six flags, though. They do got six flags. They do got yeah, six that's flags. That's a positive. Not a great city. <laughs> how, many, uh, how many games did you play up there? Four. Four? Oh, yeah. That must have been cool as shit, though. It was cool. It was, I enjoyed it, yeah. I mean, that's like, that right there is showing that you're getting closer to your goal. I, w- I was, uh, it was fun. I was like a third, fourth line guy there. Yeah. And I knew that, so like, I was just playing fast, forechecking, hitting, like, just playing my role, and it was fun. Yeah, right. It was good. Nice. That's fucking sick, dude. I can I can never do what he does. Is I would get very very afraid. I'm Dude, smacked with that stick. Let me tell you, and getting yeah. body slammed. I got my first game in A. I got a puck in my chin. Oh, oh. <laughs> you got a visor though. I hope at least. Well, the visor. Yeah, yeah obviously See, like, it's not gonna protect I'm you. Missing there. a patch on my beard. Oh my god, <laughs> is that from that? I got a puck to the chin. Yeah, my first game in the A. Shit. It happens. It's yeah. uh, it's shitty, but. It's that thing's god. really hard that, too, uh, bro. You have to be so ballsy to play hockey. Yeah, so dude. So ballsy. A lot. You know why? A lot of people get <laughs> fucked up. Yeah, because you can just like get cut by the like that skates too, and stuff. Yeah. Like anything. Um, scary. That happened to somebody. That was years ago. To a few a people. Few he got his. Uh, Talking about the that goalie was a or the years ago. But yeah, okay. a long time ago. How My dad that? actually. My dad got when he was in college. This one is not public, like uh, popular in the public because he was college. It was in the eighties. He was. Uh, he has a big scar here to here, so he was on the. He got like knocked down. He's on the ice, and a guy stepped on his. No, oh. was it on purpose or just? How do you? There's like, I, it's there's hard to accidentally speculation. Step on something. There's think. speculation that it was on purpose. Right. And uh, yeah, he's got a like big scar here. He had like 160 stitches. Ooh. Dude, it's a f- scary thing. And he, like, just just or since I brought the story, like the so he like jumped up, and like skated to the bench with like blood. Yeah, yeah, literally, when that happens, it's yeah, like it's squirting, crazy. and he goes to the bench, and the trainer faints, like passes out. <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, he was so great. grossed out by it. Yeah, and uh, someone like ran down upstairs and like stapled his neck shut and like saved his life. So he literally got lucky. His he shit almost then. died. Yeah. The only thing god. that I would do, because I've had I've seen that happen before, yeah. where people like dislocate shoulders, and it, for me personally, like I have like a scar here yeah. and then I have another one here where I had to get staples or whatever from playing sports and I've never seen anything like that yeah. but when when people start bleeding oh nasty you see all the weak people because they go oh plus God. that that's the <laughs> ice too so like yeah. it's so you know white yeah. on, on it so yeah. it's I bet that was really popping yeah <laughs> it's gross man I, even like my chin when last year it split open like I went I knew it was bleeding because it didn't, it just felt, I could feel, I was like, shit, tell. that, uh, and I like touched, I was like, shit, that's definitely bleeding. Right. And I, I went back and I was like, hey, I, I'm bleeding. And he was like, whoa, <laughs> yeah, you are. I'm like, oh, <laughs> sick. It doesn't look that good, does it? <laughs> like, yeah, you you never want to hear that. Like oh, that. Shit. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, all right. I was like, is it bad? He's like, yeah, it's, it's a good one. So what, they just stitch you up and you yeah. go back out or? Dude. No, he glued me. He like Ooh. put glue in it, and I play the rest of the game with an open fucking chin. Oh, <laughs> oh my god! I, I remember my line mate was like, "Hey, what happened to you?" All right, I was like, "Yeah," and he was like, "Oh!" <laughs> it's like, oh. <laughs> I was like, "Oh, it's yeah." <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> they, they I always I, it after. Yeah. I feel like when you get hurt anywhere with like a serious thing, the person that tells you if it's bad or not, it's always like, "Oh, it's not that bad." Yeah, yeah. And you know, usually the I don't trust let- no one with that question. <laughs> no, no, I right? Trust yeah. nobody. It's it's nasty looking, man. I just yeah. can't believe that that person kind of like saved his life though. He literally straight up yeah, ran freaky, down. Freaky, freaky just, shit. What do you mean when you say staple the neck though? Is that like a real staples? Like a Dude, staple? You know, I didn't make I it past high school, bro. I didn't ask him like the specifics of that. What that meant when he said stapled his neck? I know like there's medical staples, staples. Mm-hmm. right? Yeah. Like straight, yeah. like like an actual, like literally, it's like, like this metal, like yeah, straight up. Metal. I think they're metal. And yeah, so it just goes and just crimps it. And clothes, I think so. You don't. Yeah. So it's like the butterfly band aids. Except with staples, with staples. Except way stronger. Yeah. yeah. It's, yeah. it's made for emergency on the battlefield. So when people were getting like cuts, nicks, and like, you know, something would happen, they have a huge gash. Instead of them bleeding out, because the first thing you're supposed to do is stop all the blood. Right. But if it's happening like somewhere like your neck, artery, or whatever, right. you want to close it as fast as possible because you can lose blood. And if you lose too much blood, obviously, you know what happens. Right. So they have those staples and go, they literally go, Chunk, 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 chunk. Yeah, and they can't be like normal staples yeah, because. So and then, the, then, then your body does the rest. It, the, you know, 
Wait, yeah, but getting that shit in your neck, though? Whatever. Oh, yeah. Neck, yeah. That's scary as hell. I mean, it's yeah, better it than was, bleeding out and dying. Oh, no, exactly. Yeah. I'd be like, do it. It was like, <laughs> li- dude, yeah. it, was, it was like life or death situation. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, for sure. Because you, like, your neck's open and he's bleeding that long. Like, he had to do something on the spot. Yeah, like, so right like then. That, I actually met the guy, weirdly. No shit. Like, the dude that year, did it? Yeah, like, years later, because my dad's a NHL scout now, so... When I was a kid, we would go to the BC That's games. That's so lot. sick. I yeah, know. I know. <laughs> I know. That's a cool job. The uh, more things you cool. discover. <laughs> <laughs> this is the best first podcast, bro. Oh, my 